you all here for the ninth Cookbook Club. Um, very proud, very excited and humbled and honoured to have Derry Clark, um, a Michelin star chef here today. And uh, uh, when, I, when I first met Derry I was struck, obviously he's an amazing talent in France and an incredible ambassador if you like of the best food you can get in this country. But also he's a really good um, dinner guest, a really nice man. You just chat to him, he's been very kind. <laughs> He's been really I kind agree. to me, and uh, so if you want to invite him to dinner, away. <laughs> I'm sure he'll come. And uh, I'm going to just mention, I see the I forgot to put the title of the cookbook on the menu, but it is called Not Just a Cookbook, and it's the uh, Le Cruvan Cookbook. Uh, all the dishes are laid out, and the, the pages in the cookbook from which they're from are beside them as well. And uh, the cookbook is for sale tonight. It's only. I'd say. <laughs> you look rich. I say tenor. How's that? Uh, sorry, for cash, cash only. No credit cards. That, that's fantastic. It's an amazing book, and there's like three different uh, uh, ways to do the dish. And one dish as well. Um, and that's for sale over there. We'll, we'll have you come and meet there in sign shop. He's going to go around to all your tables now anyway and meet everybody. And he's got to get round to everybody twice. restaurant in Ireland tonight. For sure. First of all, uh, you know, when Elaine did ask me to uh, come along tonight, um, I, I'll be honest with you, I didn't realise you know, what I'm coming into. But i got to say, you know, what a girl. Elaine, watch, what a girl you are. <laughs> the, uh, they always say simple ideas are always the best ideas, aren't they really? And this idea is so simple, you know, it's uh, about a cookbook, the cook, the book, and Elaine. But, but also it's about uh, you guys being here tonight. I mean, obviously it wouldn't work if you weren't here tonight. So really, that is why it's, it's successful, isn't it, really? All you've been here tonight, on a Monday night, being here together. Um, and the great thing about it is having the chef behind here, Declan Dunn, and his team. Declan Dunn! Uh, I know Declan uh, over the years, and he's a brilliant, brilliant chef. Um, he's from Kilkenny. He, 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 so he, he does play soccer <laughs> and rugby and football. This day hurry at all. Okay. But uh, no, it's great. Uh, I was talking about Declan about the book and you know uh, the recipes, and I said, you know, Declan, Derry, what do I do? And they said, Derry, what do you do? And I said, listen, surprise me. You know, you pick out what you want to do, and. Um, he did. Um, I haven't really seen the menu just now, tonight. Uh, I didn't see it beforehand, and uh, great choices, I must say, Declan and Lady. But uh, the thing about it is, about recipes and cookbooks, is um, when you have a cookbook in front of you and you're doing a recipe, is have your own interpretation. You, know, you have your own interpretation of it, yeah. and your own pick. Yeah. You know, uh, everyone in this room, I guess now, I'm guessing that you cook. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't be here tonight if you didn't, really. If you're interested in food. And you know, when you cook uh, a dish from a recipe book, no matter who it is, and some great books out there, is um, have your stamp on it. You know, your, your, your personality, your soul, your effort, the work you put into a dish. I mean, we've all been there, I'm sure, in this room, you had, say, uh, friends over tonight, and you started working today on, on your menu, your starter, main course, dessert. And we've all seen that, well, they uh, come dine with me. Yeah. You know, we've seen that. And funny enough, that's a great program for me as a chef. Because people at home see what the effort goes into making a meal. You know, and probably the best thing you can do in life actually is to cook for someone, to cook for your friends, for your family. It's probably the best thing anyone can do, really. It's kind of uh, self satisfying. It's um, unique, it's different, but also you're putting what you are onto that menu, onto that dish. Now, sometimes, let's be honest about it, sometimes it works. <laughs> 
Most times it doesn't work. So, and that's what really is so interesting. I mean, that's why uh, Elaine um, said there, you know, this idea I had, and uh, I know you have several cooks and chefs involved in over the last what, year or two years in this. Uh, and they've all said the same thing. You know, it's great. You know, I think I will meet you all by the way. I'll go around the tables and you can give me the hard times. Uh, one thing I will say before I finish, I don't talk too much. Am I talking too much? Yeah. Okay. Um, someone said to me, always, I always meet people here and there and say, Jerry, I need the recipe, blah, blah, blah. I said, oh, the first thing I say, did it work? <laughs> did it work? Because, you know, um, and every cook will tell you that. Uh, when, you do, when you do a recipe, you always ask, you know, did it work? Because I've kind of been intrigued by that. Um, obviously, you know, um, desserts now. Desserts is one area where you pretty much have to go by the recipe. We all know why, you know, because we put in, you know, 500 grams of flour and um, a drop of water. Doesn't really work, does it? <laughs> but uh, the menu tonight, I mean, was picked, and I've got to say, it was, sorry, it was a nice menu. I mean, I don't know, if you just see who picked what now, I mean, the soup, the spice soup, who picked that? Hands up. Very few. I know why, by the way, because you said, I want to buy these words tonight. I'm not going to pick that soup. Okay, hands up who picked the salmon with lobster, you see? And you picked that because lobster was there, didn't you? Hands up who picked because it was lobster. I uh, think you're honest, honest, honest. But it's true, you see, it's funny, it's funny if uh, we always say, funny enough in the menu, you see a restaurant menu? The first item on the menu is normally what we want to sell. You know that, don't you? If you look at the menu, the first item is always the one the chef wants to sell. Okay? Remember that. Um, always is. If you have the first item on the starters and the first item on the main course, that's the thing that we sell every night. Okay? A tip for you. There you are now. Free of charge. But no, really for me, it's unique location tonight, and uh, it's all of you, ladies and gentlemen, the here tonight has made this tonight. And I'm going to say one thing here tonight before I finish uh, on this microphone, because I don't know why I got a microphone, I talk too much. But uh, Elaine Walsh, you are spectacular, the idea you have is, it should be actually rolling out everywhere, because it's brilliant, because it brings people together for interesting food. Um, as a chef and drink cook cooks, I think it's brilliant, because it's all, it works together, doesn't it? It works yes. together. So, um, listen, what the words the saying is, uh, bon appetit.